Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more Inscription Casey's Mod. We got a special episode today here. We're, we're doing a zero challenge run, <laughs> zero challenge modifier run. Probably zero challenge too, though, let's be honest. Because the, the strangest thing happened in a couple of the past few episodes. I, I've said, What do you want me to do next in this series? You know, do you want me to keep going? All of that. And for the first time in the history on my channel, I actually got a relatively unanimous outpouring of people saying, you know what? It's fine if you want to move on. It's fine if you want to move on and come back after maybe some updates and stuff. So that's what we're going to do. That is what we're going to do. We are, are we're going to do our last run here today for a little bit. And then hopefully soon there will be some updates. Hopefully we find a time to, uh, to play those new decks that come out, especially any major updates that will happen. Hopefully we'll just sneak in a video. Uh, but alas, let us find something cool to do here. I feel like the, the wolf just felt like a good choice because of, you know, the obvious there. Uh... Infinisac. I feel like we, we played Infinisac yesterday. Let's go with Warren. Let's go with uh, Warren. But yeah, this year's, it's, it's been so, so fun. It's a very special game, very special series. I really enjoyed it. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll be back later after it's been updated more. What do we want to upgrade here? You know what? We, we did like Super Stoat yesterday. I'm hoping this gets e eaten. Okay, I was going to say. I'm hoping this gets eaten. Because we are more likely to draw our Warren now. If we draw our Warren, we can play a wolf on turn one, which is much better. Uh, but alas, we did not. Okay, Bullfrog can tank that hit. It's nice to have zero, like, penalties here. We're like, it's crazy to think. This is us playing, so we know that that's, we know what that is. But I guess we just do this. Um, we're more or less playing original inscription now, like the base, like the base game, which <laughs> is so funny. It feels very off at this point. I'm going to close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes. I remember like, you know, we didn't, we didn't win our first run of the base game inscription, but I think that partially that was, wasn't that due to the too fast, too soon business like that? That was something. That was something indeed. Corpse maggots. See, I don't want to take any of this. So, are we guaranteed a tadpole at any for a zero cost? Does that take up our one cost slot? Let me re-roll this. Oi. Oi, I don't like any of that. Um. I don't like any of that. Probably should have gone for the uh, the red heart. But then we might draw the red heart instead of our... Um... If we get HP here, though. Okay, never mind. Hmm. This is weird. This is very weird. I could have a 3-2 bullfrog or a removed bullfrog. That's fine by me. It's kind of... Yeah, I was going to say. I my, I think my preferred is that it gets removed. Now we kind of just want to remove the beehive, I guess. Uh, yes. Strange, strange, strange. So finally we did get the war in. Good stuff. Now we can play wolf turn one. Which is a lethal on turn two. Guarantee. I don't know what to do with Mr. Mr. Beehive, though. I feel like a, a totem. Hmm. Nah, I, I, I can't risk... You can't risk getting a card oh, that you have no control over. I don't want any of that for sure, though. Mealworm. We'll take Mealworm. We'll take Mealworm. Hopefully, we can, uh, we can sacrifice the sigil... For what? I mean... Depends. Okay, we got HP. That's actually nice. K. 
<laughs> this is strange. This is strange. So we could tank with this a couple of times or it gets eaten. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Maybe we give the um Maybe we give that the mealworm sigil now. So we go down, it tanks a hit. And then it gives a big old chunk of HP. Beehive is not helpful. Sure. Just wanted to get the squirrel out of the way. I don't know, man. This can go awry if this uh, turns into, you know, like a... Okay, first of all, this is just... This is just now a bunch of health. If this turned into flying ant, a flying ant parade, getting the wolf out on turn two instead of turn one could be a pretty big deal, all in all. Ooh, skink could be fun. Okay, hear me out. Hear me out. There's a fun thing we can do here with Skink and Beehive. But it's... I guess wait, we put the Skink on the Beehive then. And not the reverse. Uh, do we have three items? We do not. But yeah, like if we put the Skink... On the beehive, but I wanted to put the mealworm on the beehive. We could do both. If we had a second beehive, if we took that early, we could have done something there. What are we fighting right now for a boss? Are we fighting Trapper? If we're fighting Trapper, beehive is really nice. Skink beehive is really, really nice. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. This leads to some really stupid stuff if we manage to get the um, the bug totem, which we don't even have a piece for. Ah, we're going for the um, the fisherman. The fisherman. Gotcha. Got ya. Hello there, mister. Can't tank that. Huh. <laughs> what do I... What do I... What am I... What is my goal? I guess I want to top deck the wolf? Because we're at... This is lethal, right? That's lethal. If I top deck the wolf... Wolf, I can. Okay, awesome. That that's so ideal. This is this run is just going so clean. It's weird. It's so weird how clean the run is going. Uh, because we can do mealworm into wolf, wolf, uh, wolf, 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 wolf. wolf. Actually, let me do that before I forget. But yeah, beehive with the uh, loose tail is interesting. We could generate, potentially, we could generate two bees in the same turn, and then the tail should get the double buff of the HP. Uh, theoretically. One would think. It's, it's done it in the past. I cannot... God, it's, do I take sus man? Sussman is a better card than anything we have in our deck right now. I think he works okay. Isurak? I think he's fine. We can't buff him up or anything. It's kind of a, a unique downside that he has. Goo Man! Goo Man. That is strange. I think that we actually want to succeed at this then. K 
Kin is interesting. Health is interesting. Kin? It's kind of funny. Uh, Kin is decently likely. Decently likely. Isherak being like uh, a guarantee nearly. To wolves, to these, to HP, HPs. HP is impossible to lose. HP is actually literally impossible to lose. I, I want this because then we might get a better thing to have two of. No, 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 actually we didn't really. Yeah, we can't add a bone card to our deck because the, the hidden system would jank things up. We have a direct removal. Wait, can I? I can't pick Sus Boy. That's disappointing. I could combine. I'm basically thinking, like, what would I want to combine at this point? Oh, bother. This is the first time I've gotten the goo event, and it's not like, holy moly, I can't believe I get a dupe. Like, I guess I'm leaning towards duping River Snapper. Hoping he buffs his health up or his attack up by one or something. Which. Hey! Let's go! Okay. Now he's something. I mean, he's, he's not bad now. He's not bad now. I would not mind a black goat draw. Boink, boink. That's a lethal. That's a lethal meatball. Do we have three items? No. Oh, wait. Um, do we want overkill? I don't, I don't care. It's weird to see the enemy use stoat. It feels inappropriate. It's a rare. All right. Um. Yeah. Uh. Black goat would be the ideal. Mm -hmm. Black goat would be the ideal. Skink we already got rid of. <laughs> That's not right. I don't know. I think I want to put the, the mealworm on the wolf. So that maybe we could like river snapper spawn with it. That's kind of fun. Hmm. It's all just kind of awkward. Oh, I love that he changes what card he is. The Isarak, look at that. He's just changing every time. There's nothing here that's really impressing me that much. Uh, I would have maybe... No, I don't want to dupe the Beehive because then it would have the Sigil. Stinky can work well, but then it's also it's adding another one cost to my deck. Whatever, fine. We can kill a card. Yeah, sure. Now you're not here, Isherak. Oh, you are. You are. I could kill you. I, this is Isherak. I don't want to kill the Isherak. I guess I'm leaning towards killing Skunk. Or I could kill the Wolf. But, like, we would have the Apple. Ideally, yeah, like, Apple and Warren on you, but then we couldn't turn one summon the Wolf. Uh, let's just kill the skunk. Let's kill the skunk. I, I was 
not really feeling adding that to my deck in the first place. So let's get rid of you. We have a fire. We have not been able to get to any totem spots, which is strange. That's Isharak. That's kind of that's kind of perfect, in fact. Isharak, perfect in fact. That's eight damage on turn one, son. Oh, you bumped my river snapper's health up to eight as well. I didn't see that coming. Uh, we don't have anything at the shop. I don't want to go do that. If we are doing mealworm on the wolf, that's not going to help us here. Um... Man. We could go Black Goat and hope for a worthy sacrifice, but it's getting a little late in the run at this point already to expect that to show up. And then we have to roll it until then. I'm actually fine with it, though, because we have a couple two costs, which is not, like, good to take this on, but it's fine is basically where I'm at with that. Do I double buff the Mealworm and it's just... Oh, wait. One of these is Azurak. I'm assuming it's this one. It's one of these two. It's not the one covered in goo, I'll tell you that much. Doing a lot of thinking today. Okay, well, I mean, there we go. There's definitely Isharak now. I don't, I don't want him gone though. I'm happy to have Isharak in all situations except for him taking place at the River Snapper. That'd be a problem. Double up the Mealworm. You know what? Let's just do it. Please. I actually don't want you eaten. Okay, of course now we don't. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Wait, now we get a backpack, don't we? Nope. Yeah. Yep, we're going to have to get a backpack. And we can't use it. Oh, wait. I thought this was a card pick. Happy. I'm happy about that. All right. I'm kind of fishing for an Isharak. items. Oops. <laughs> Stupid. I, blo I just completely blocked it. We're gonna get one B still anyways. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Wolf. Alright, we do have a lethal. We got lethal. And we do not have to get the pack, right? We get four, f what, four bucks for free? Five, six or something. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, man. I, I, If I were to change something about that whole system, I would just say, make it so the trapper doesn't give you a forced... Um, I'm going to think that that could be funny later. Make it so the trapper does not give you a forced item. That's really my big thing. Just, just, don't, just don't do that. I think that'd be better. It's probably played as generous, but it doesn't help. I'm combining these mostly to help out this river snapper. Also, he... Okay, he wasn't a 2-8 before. That was because of, um... Mealworm. I mealworm to spawn him. Okay. We did kind of get rid of maybe a, a win con. But, it's fine. Oh, beehive. We have a lot of shots at Isharak this turn, if we want it. Do I want it? Hmm. 
I don't like this. This is not the way to go. Actually, it will, it'll be alright, because wriggling leg. Oh, the wriggling leg does not get the bees within. It only gets it if I add it. Oh, but because we can still spawn with the uh, the wolf. I don't want to. I think that's silly. Poison, you little son of a gun, man. This do yeah, this doesn't work. All right, get rid of the beehive. It only works with the added sigils. That's okay. That's bad. Things are actually turning out pretty uh, terrible right now in a second. All right. Well, one of these is his wreck. I was hoping it wasn't going to be that one. Okay, we got to turn to stack up a little bit of resources here. This wolf's dead. Yeah, yeah. It's all fine. Okay, there's one. We got one squirrel. We got the skink. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine! Boink. This is... This is rough, though. I'm not going to sit here and say it ain't. That followed by that. That alpha play is kind of cracked there. That's for sure. Get him! Can't, we can't do it in a way that really... It, it doesn't matter. We, we win. Like, the, who cares? Who cares? Oh, no. I can't win in a much better way. The douse. Till it's too late for Ouroboros. Gak is fun. Infinigek for the road. Maybe we can make it happen. Now, let's take the douse. I think it may be the only card in the game I haven't used yet. <laughs> I think that I've never used the douse. Okay. Okay, we're going... I guess we're go going up to the trapper here. I think I want to fail this. If we want to fail it, then I don't think there's really a good... This is the best option we have, but it's probably... No, we're good. All right, do we sacrifice the... Uh... Sure. I don't have any bone cost cards except for the... Um, the stinker. The uh, mealworm. But now I can... I can uh, take one. I can take a, a bone card, and then I can sacrifice the mealworm, and I can guarantee play... Uh, a bone card for free, which is, should be like, what, how much? One, two, three, four, five, six, so yeah, we can, nine. We can play literally any, um, okay, we we don't want sus man here. Please no sus man. Please don't be sus man. Thank you. <laughs> this, this is, it's it's just funny to play around Izharak, you know? Early, early on in the run, he was oh, exclusively helpful. Okay, we only have one fight where we have to we should have used our item. Yeah, we we beefed it there. Take one. Yeah, let's, let's let's live a little. Finally a shrine. Okay. Awful butt. No. You know what should be able to be done is you should be able to click one of your items. Uh, to just say, I will just sacrifice this instead. Like, I would trade an item to not take an item there. But yeah, I would love to sacrifice my, um... 
Oh boy. Awkward. I can find out. Interact now. Okay. Sacrifice my mealworm. Get a high oh high bone cost card. Oh, this is this right here is straight up smelly. Uh, let's just win then, I guess. I guess I'll win. I'm looking for a high bone cost card up to nine, I guess, so which is should be anything. Because we can play it for free. Okay, Wolverine sucks. We have a merge thing coming up. What are, what are we going to merge? Man, what's the best card to take that's just by itself? Uh, not super happy about that, though. Okay. All right. Fine. Today's the day that all the world will see. Sure. Omega Douse. Have another merge. Could get a fire and a merge there, too. not get Omega Douse. I don't think I can actually, like, really play the Douse here. But I can't play him and use him ap appropriately, so I'll just do this and I'll win. I'll just, like, win instead, if that's okay, I guess. I know we could go up there and get double merge. See it changing like that? That's kind of cool. Uh, no to the opossum. I think it's a the dire wolf doesn't make a lot of stuff. I could put it on the ma the the other mount. Wow, the douse. Ugh. I should have taken the kingfisher and put it on the douse. That could have been fun. What do I do? I want you gone. All right. What the hell do we do? What do we do now? Generating bones per turn and upgrade after a turn. Just, sure. Let's just make a cool new douse, man. Let's just make a cool new douse. So this is Trapper. We're almost done. Man. Zero challenge level is not challenging. Who would have thought? I know some people will, like, end out the series with, like, uh, probably, like, oh, let's go back to, let's go back to do all the challenge modifiers. I, but I'm going to be honest, and again, not end the series, I guess we, I do intend to come back, but sometimes you just don't know, so. Uh, what the heck do we do here? How does this... But I, I just... I feel like it makes more sense to have it be... Oh, boy. Fun. That's pretty cool. He is going to die. Da -da. I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna do this because it's funny. 
I love how he just, yeah. Spawn in, kill himself. Take one damage. Oh, no. But, like, yeah. I, I truly think that the better idea is just, like, let's let's play the part of the game that I think is was, was most fun and, and most special. It's just, like, let's get back to the special beginning part. I don't know. I just, I felt like that's where the game shines, especially, you know. Boink. Should get upgraded. Elder the Douse! <laughs> Elder the Douse! There's something funny about that to me. There's something really funny about that. Uh... He's gonna, like, kind of wreck him a little bit, though. El Elder the Douse. Because the chime will get hit. He'll get hit. I mean, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I might be able to, like, leave it up for a turn. You can grab this one, this one, you know? Ah, the schmoove, though. This is actually... Wait, this sucks big time. I can leave this one. Holy moly! This is terrible. Is Direwolf coming down gonna ruin my day? Is Grizzly coming down gonna ruin my day? You know what, let's just, let's just freestyle it a little bit here. What could go wrong? Okay, so, this attacks, Elder of the Douse attacks it, Elder of the Douse attacks here, Wobble attacks this, Elder of the Douse attacks this, uh, Mud Turtle attacks us, we do three. This comes down. We can yank it. I, I kind of just want to freestyle and just see what happens. I, don't, I never get to play that way. I always have to. Feel, I always feel like I have to think. What if we just like didn't think and we just won? Okay. See, it works out. Just don't think. Just don't think, forehead. I shouldn't. I shouldn't have done that. I just like shouldn't have done it. I just like basically just shouldn't have done that. It was for no reason. I was like, ah, it's the final fight. It's not the final fight. <laughs> it's not the final fight at all. But hey, like I said, no think. Also, I can't think of a more fitting end than just like a very clean mono a mono leshy fight. Like we really don't have anything. I don't. I don't need another douse. He's not good. I'm gonna take a gex. Screw you, game. I don't need another one. I have Elder the douse. Eh, mono mono's overrated. Ooh, I really want to play with that. Ooh, I really want to play with that. I guess that might be something. <laughs> okay, these are these are fun. So about that mono a mono. Hey, screw it. Overrated. All right, there, there's some there's some goofy stuff we could do.
I actually think this is going to be surprisingly tough. I genuinely... Well, never mind. I take it back. <laughs> All right. This could be the sus man. It's not. We win. Okay. Cool. Boink, boink. About that mono a mono clean fight. I just overrated. I didn't, I didn't care about it at all. <laughs> okay. Should have done that first, technically, but it's it's irrelevant. Yoink, boink, and a doink. This moon is waning. So much value. The douse. Interesting. I, I didn't know how that was going to work. S this snapper it has it on its own. It, I promise you this snapper has it on its own. And now we have a very gnarly little wave of, uh, of bees coming our way. Actually, it didn't attack it. Oh, that's weird how that happens, huh? So it tries to attack this, but it doesn't try to attack the beehive because it didn't happen. I got... Huh. Strang. Get him, Mr. Snapper. But of course. Elder, the douse is coming for you. Get rid of him. I want. I want. I can't get rid of the chime. I wanted. To, I wanted Elder the Douse to be the one. All right. Screw it. Send it. Elder the Douse, my boy. Thank you for joining us. It was the last card. I, I really do think it was the last card that we we had never used before. We have used every other card, uh, and it's funny because the Douse is not a new card. It, it was in the base game. But yes, alas, alas, that is that, and that is going to do it here for Inscription Casey's Mod for now. Uh, knowing my luck, there's going to be an update tomorrow. Knowing my luck, there's going to be an update by the time this video goes out, and it's going to add, like, add the two new decks or something. But yeah, I'll, I will try and come back to do like uh, a couple, you know, if they add a new deck, I'll, like, I'll try to come back, do a one-off on it or something like that. Or depending on what they add, I might come back for a video. Or I might come back for a couple of videos. We'll see. Maybe we will look into modded inscription in the future. But there's a couple cool releases that have come out. And I, like I said, I've never gotten such a unanimous... Not that I necessarily need a blessing or anything. But I, I was expecting more backlash about saying that, hey, maybe, you know, maybe it's time that we wrap up for now since we completed our objective. Uh, but, yeah, there's a... a I, 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 I thank you guys for, for that as well. Like. Sometimes it's very difficult to, to say goodbye to a series, especially one that's super, super fun, super special, which I do think that this one is and was and will be in the future when it comes back in whatever form. But when it comes back, by the way, they, I'm, I, I will probably not have episode numbers because it might, you know, who knows? If it's a couple weeks from now, people will be like, maybe they're new to the channel and they're like, what the heck? Episode 39? Like, I'll probably, it'll probably just be a self-contained thing. Like, new blank deck, you know, Inscription Casey's Mod, new blank deck or whatever. So, just so you know what to look out for, uh, that's probably the way I'll go about it if I were to guess when that stuff does get added. Because, again, it's, the, it's gonna, it's gonna show up. It's like, it's, it's there. There's a couple card unlocks that, uh, theoretically are gonna be added as well. Uh, potentially the lore. Like, we'll, we'll see. Depending on how, what gets added and how it gets added, everything... Will entirely determine how we come back. But for now, I am I'm excited to do a couple, you know, like mini series uh on the channel. Like I, I'm looking forward to a couple games that I just didn't have a time slot for, but now I do. Uh greatly appreciated. 
all of the support on this series. It's been phenomenal. This game is incredible. Casey's mod just makes it even better. It was already my goatee last year. It was already my goatee. Casey's mod came out afterwards and just said, hey, you know, what if goatee X2? So, alas, alas, that's that. That's going to do it for today. Hopefully you will stay tuned. Check out a new series starting tomorrow. I don't know what it, I don't know what it is yet. <laughs> new mini series starting tomorrow. That's how I fly by the seat of my pants here on the old Retromation channel. It's my full-time job, and I just flex... I flex where you guys tell me to. So thank you for, for your feedback. Uh, thank you for not being toxic with backseating. This is a turn-based roguelike, and typically that breeds terrible backseating. You guys were lovely, genuinely. I, I appreciate you, and I cannot say that uh, sincerely enough. I, I genuinely appreciate how non-toxic you guys were. Uh, with backseating, it was minimal. It was kind when it was there. I appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. And I hope to see you tomorrow. I hope that you are not just, or I mean, or if you even were, if you were just an inscription viewer, I hope that you found enough pleasure in watching my videos, me, and you want to check out another video of mine and maybe another series. There's all kinds of great ones, I've, I've, especially if you like roguelike deck builders. I've got more series on roguelike deck builders than you can shake a stick at. If you want a wild recommendation, I have a big backlog of Monster Train, for example. I love that game. Um, that's, that's one you could go take a look at, but again, we'll have a new series starting tomorrow. And honestly, it's, there's a 50, 50 chance. It's going to be a deck builder anyways. So stick around. I'll see you there. Thank you for watching again, more inscription when there is more inscription to play. We have, we have sort of done what we needed to do and we'll be back when there's more to do. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you. Check out the channel for roguelikes and more every single day. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.